Aquarius. Hey, Aquarius. It's Faith from Fire Sign Tara. Hope everybody's well. So sorry for the delay in your March reading. Life happened again, but we're rolling with it. So, that being said, if you are new here, anything you need to know about this video is in the description box. Go down, take a peek. It's next to that old like button, that subscribe button, the notification bell. If you feel so inclined to want to come back, maybe hang out a little bit more, you hit those three bells. Makes my job a little bit easier. So, again, I'm going to tip down and just hop right into it. But, in that their description box is also where else you can find us on social media. And, why is that there? I never put my coffee mug there. If you are interested in a private reading, I only have four or five slots open every month just because my life is so insane and I'm not in this for the money. I'm in this to spread peace, love, and light to the world because I feel that that is what I was compelled to do. So, if I make a few pennies, that's cool. If I don't make anything, that's cool too. Again, not why I'm here. All right. Okay, give me a flyer. The Wheel of Fortune, Aquarius. Well done. Very nice. Things are looking up. The Wheel of Destiny is spinning in a direction. Give me five. One. Two. Three, four, and five. Is it spinning up? Is it spinning down? Something's coming too close. Something can begin. It is a ten. The question is, which direction is the spin going to take you? Huh. Why do I feel like this is an unnecessary conversation? Knight of Wands reversed at the bottom of the deck. Something is about to stop dead in its tracks. If it is moving, it is barely moving at this point because you are not thrilled. I feel like you're dealing with someone who doesn't necessarily express emotions very well. I think you're a little hung up. But as unnecessary as this conversation may be, I think it is preordained. Do the energy of the person that Aquarius is dealing with. Hi, Justice. Ooh, this could be a legal matter for some of you. You may just be dealing with a Libra. Scorpio, Taurus, Leo, Aquarius, Libra. Okay.
five of wands reversed, the avoidance of conflict, the watching from afar possibly, things aren't moving. Fighting a death cycle, no communication. Until the end all be all conversation. That leads us from stagnant to stuck. This was preordained. Wheel of Fortune is sitting next to justice. That is the mighty sort of justice coming down to cut something out of someone's life. Wow. Can I get one? I need a flyer. Hi. Temperance. Oh yeah, three majors, you better believe it. Empress at the bottom. What is meant to grow shall grow. When the waters are right and things come together as they should. Patience with the process. Patience with the process. If it is meant to grow, it will. If it is not, it will not. There's no sense in fighting the death cycle. Okay. Seven. King of Wands reversed. Why? King of Cups. King of Cups. That doggone poker face. The emotion is there. It is not being expressed. That's why things aren't moving. Someone isn't expressing their emotions. They're keeping them inside. How do you feel about them? Why is the King of Cups here? How do you feel about them, Aquarius? Strength reverse. You think they're holding something back. Confusion. Five of Wands, the avoidance of conflict, the confusion. Maybe they don't know how they feel, and that's why they're not expressing emotions. Maybe that's why they're holding things back. Or are you the one holding things back? Are you the one that doesn't know how you feel? Are you the one trying to avoid conflict? Maybe there's an internal struggle going on because of the confusion. I don't know. I'm not there, guys. Talk to me. What you think of them? Why the hangman reversed? Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands upright, Eight of Wands reversed. High Priestess reversed. Hung up. Moving forward, but still hung up. Disconnecting, not happy.
Unable to sort it out. Can't find the cups. Things moving quickly. Why the devil reversed? Ten of Pentacles reversed. Knight of Wands reversed. Lack of forward movement. Something isn't moving. We get so bound to something it becomes toxic. It affects everything. And this has you hung up, Aquarius. This has you hung up. Is it gonna move or it's gonna end? It's gonna move or it's gonna end. I'm trying to avoid conflict. It's gonna move or it's gonna end. Before we address this, why is the Six of Pentacles reversed here? They're torn. They can't decide. Someone is fiercely independent. Do I extend this cup to myself or do I extend this cup to another? Which cup is fuller? Is the cup I give myself going to be fuller than the cup that this person gives me? Weighing options. They're weighing options. I can't decide. Do I have enough to give? Do I have enough to give? <clears throat> the avoidance of conflict. The poker face. The emotion is there, but it is not expressed. Why is death reversed here? Why is death reversed here? Avoiding the emotion, avoiding the death cycle, not processing. Lovers reversed. Page of Wands reversed. Knight of Pentacles reversed. They think you're fighting an ending. King of Wands, hell or high water move forward, shoot first, ask questions later, just go, 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 but this guy has a tendency to go, 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 just to go, 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 doesn't always finish things, king of wands upright, king of wands reversed. It's just, wow, hold on a second. Okay, where was I? Lovers reversed, page of wands reversed, knight of pentacles reversed. <sighs> pulling back, pulling back, pulling back. Unprocessed emotions, pulling back, fighting the death cycle, fighting the ending so the new can begin. It's going to move or it's going to end. Why is the eight of wands here? Why the eight of wands reversed for what the other person thinks of Aquarius? Nine of Wands upright. Queen of Wands reversed at the bottom of the deck. Oh man. Three of Cups reversed. Eight of Wands. Every time you get quiet, they think you're off plan. Every time you get quiet, every time you got quiet, they're avoiding confrontation. Throw it in the towel. They throw in the towel a lot.
that's a whole lot. Lock the door, no commitment. That's stuck if I've ever seen it. That's stuck in a never ending cycle. They come back, it falls apart again, there's a lack of commitment. Return doesn't go as planned. Somebody gets stuck and things don't end. Let's try that again. Ten of swords reversed. The painful cycle never ends. That's baggage. They're stuck in a painful cycle that never ended. And if you're not outplaying, that's where they think you are because that's where their head says you are because that's what happened last time and the time before that and the time before that. It didn't even have to be with you. Internal conflict, confusion, withholding, the withholding of emotion, the withholding of emotion because they don't want to get emotionally attached. Hanged man reverse, stuck, unhappy. Trying to move forward and disconnect. You know they're trying, but they're still stuck somewhere else. Something that didn't work out. Wow. Holy shit. Okay. It's going to move or it's going to end. Five of swords, five of swords, five of swords. Eight of cups. Nine of swords reversed. Justice reversed. King of Swords reversed. Three of Wands reversed. It's going to move or it's going to end and somebody's going to move on. There's going to be bad attitudes. That's not fair. That's not fair. And you stay stuck. Lady Justice can't cut things out of your life to bring things back into balance if you're stuck. No connection. We're going to go over this in a second. Why the Ace of Pentacles reversed. Well, I guess if it doesn't move, it doesn't move. If it doesn't grow, it doesn't grow. It's no skin off my ass. King of Pentacles reversed. Wheel of Fortune reversed. Oh, guys. Gosh, guys. Didn't I say something about this being an unnecessary conversation? If it's come to this, or it's about to come to this, or if it hasn't come to this point yet, be careful how you have this conversation. Because how this conversation goes down could be whether you're stuck or not. I think the long time coming of trying to avoid conflict is only going to make the conflict explode. Two of Cups reversed. Heartbreak. Queen of Swords, Ace of Swords. But... This beginning happens before this end does. The heartbreak, the disconnect, the okay, fine. Psst. Page of Wands reversed. Block communication, things not going forward, watching from afar. Judgment in the Page of Cups. The Resurrection, the Apology. 
That's where the ultimatum comes in. Here, event reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. The return that did not go so well. Dang. Truth be spoken. Maybe a little too late, but truth be spoken. New yeah, wisdom. Wow. Fork in the road. Number 13. 3 plus 1 is 4. 4 is stability. 13 is also just happens to be the number of the death card. Death speaks of endings and beginnings. If a chubby little caterpillar going into that cocoon, becoming a moth and eating your sweaters, you know, however you want to look at it. Something could happen that you cannot go back from. So be careful what crawls into that cocoon. Time to make a decision, considering the consequences as you prepare to act. Owning up to your obligation to make a necessary choice. Every choice has a consequence. You've arrived at a fork in the road and you're being asked to come to a decision. Will you further your dreams by choosing left or by choosing right? Will you, make the road, will you take the road less traveled or the well, one well worn by others who have come before you? This is your choice and yours alone to make. Circumstances and other people will not make it for you. Be present and do not avoid this junction, for it is an important crossroads. Take heart, as no matter which path you choose, you'll have a rich and meaningful experience. On a side note, sometimes those really shitty experiences are the most meaningful ones. Relationship message. You've reached a moment of truth in the evolution of your relationship. Which will you choose to open up to the possibility of love or remain isolated? To go deeper and commit to mutual passion or to walk away? This is a time to take responsibility for your truest desire and follow it. Be honest with yourself about what you're willing to do, invest and give then choose. You cannot make a wrong choice. If you move forward with this relationship, know that it will be based in truth and authenticity. You will have made a conscious decision rather than simply hanging on because you don't want to be alone or ending things because you're afraid of the intensity of genuine connection. All roads lead to the lessons you must learn in your relationships. Regardless of the decision you make, it will place you on the path to a truer experience of the heart, preordained. Bang, 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 Aquarius. You and Gemini did it to me today. You and Gemini did it to me today. Y'all don't want to miss this. All right, guys. Okay. This concludes the March readings. I Again, I apologize for the delay. Um, hopefully, once spring gets here and I start feeling better, readings will pick up. My energy level will pick up. Hopefully. We'll see how things go. Um, know that we, but know that you are loved. Be blessed. I send you off with peace, love, and light. And I will catch you, my Aquarian babies, whenever next time may be. Take care.